I'm Allison, and I want to share with you today a really neat story, a little experience that I had one Sunday morning on the way to church. I was on time, which is a minor miracle in and of itself. And as I'm heading down our road and get to the highway, I see this white pickup truck pulled off the highway, but blocking partially my access to the highway. I think, oh, those tourists, they'll just pull over wherever they want. And then I proceed a little further, and I look to the left, and I look to the right, and I see their hood up. Oh, completely convicted for that previous thought. And I make eye contact with him, so I know that I need to roll down the window and say, can I help you? And he says, uh, you know, our truck's broken down. Is there any way I can use a phone? And I kind of look down at the clock and think, so much for being on time. And I say, yeah, climb on in. I'll take you back up to my house, and you can call whoever you need to call. So he says, as we're driving up the road to my house, I hope we're not making you late for anything. And I say, well, I was heading to church and that just opened the door. And he said, we've been praying for someone to come along. So that was pretty cool. That made me smile and be a little bit okay with the fact that I was now gonna be late for what was a really busy Sunday at church. So I knew I needed to get there on time. So they call AAA and while the father and son are taking care of the details, I'm able to share a cup of coffee with the dad and my husband goes out and swaps cars for me because I had our smaller family car and I needed a car that could accommodate more people because I was going to take the rest of his family to town. So we get down to back down to their truck and AAA is on the way. Their family loads into our other car which perfectly accommodated the number of people that they had with them, the number of passengers. And we had a nice visit on the way in. The whole time I'm watching my speed, because I've already been pulled over once on the way to church for speeding. It just makes you later, it's not good. So I was being very diligent about following those speed limits. I get up to church, get a parking spot, hustle in and I walk into the gym and it's empty. There's no one in there. There's still preaching or singing going on. I don't even remember at this point in time. And I just was like, God, you're awesome. If he would have been there next to me, I'd have punched him in the arm and been like, you are so cool. Like, look how you just stretched that time. You got me where you needed me and you used me and you blessed me and you blessed other people. And that was just awesome. So the whole experience was something that I feel honored to have been a part of. It was just um, a perfect example of how God uses us where He needs us. He puts us where He needs us to be in that time. And if we call on Him, He's in the details and He meets our needs.